Baltimore came up with a block there on Shelby Calhoun as well. Calhoun with a steal, sends it over. Frederick breaks it up again. Tinley Dow comes up with it, then some contact. And Shelby Calhoun with a shove as they feel that that first contact there from Tinley Dow, who was on the floor, a little too aggressive. And the team's going to separate quickly. You will likely see. The we, double technical. I here. was going to say, are we going to see the classic double tech? Minute 26. Full speed. Calhoun across. It's stolen. The elbow to Harris. And then Calhoun with the push from behind. And some words to follow. So definitely a foul there on the elbow. And then the push from behind from Calhoun. And it was, looks like to me, a bit extra there by Tentley Dow. And so the deliberation continues between Tom Danaher, Denise Brooks, and Katie Lukinich. Musketeers coming back out of the huddle, Courtney Pringer. So here it is one more time. You see the elbow there from Dow. And then Calhoun sticking up for her teammate, gives the shove from behind. Well, Calhoun is still on the floor, so she wouldn't be disqualified from play here this afternoon. Kenley Dow also back out. Two fouls on the Musketeers, an intentional foul. So Taylor Smith gets a tech for taunting, for talking. Did Tinley Down not get anything for the elbow? No call there. It was two fouls against the Musketeers. Wow. Dow was charged with a turnover somehow in that transaction. So this is McLemore at the free throw line. First one was for the foul. Now it'll be two shots for the technical. So... Just to recap, a technical foul on Taylor Smith. That was for the, uh, yes, okay, both of them. So two fouls, one of them for Taylor Smith for taunting for what she was saying afterwards, and then the other one, the Shelby Calhoun for the shove from behind and nothing on the Bulldogs. Three-point swing there for the Butler Bulldogs. They had scored from the field in the last 449. 